I often get asked, uh, should my stroke be wristy, less wristy, uh, a blend of arm swing, shoulders, how much should I move when I putt? I think this is a great uh, skill-based drill that you can try out. David Orr, one of the great putting instructors in the world, uh, kind of told me a little bit about this, but I've, I've listened to other players too and watched other players and how much hands, how much wrists, forearms, upper arms, shoulders, they turn, they tilt. Try it out. So watch this. I'm going to start with the wristiest stroke I can make. Then I'm going to go in the exact opposite and feel like there's no wrist at all, no nothing but just a little bit of arm swing like a Zach Johnson. But here, the first putt, I'm going to feel really wristy, like the butt end of the club is moving all over the place, backwards and forward. Wristy stroke. How much control would I have with that? That's my wristy feel. Pretty good putt. Now I'm going to go more stiff wristed Steve Strickers like this. No hinge, Jason Day. Can I make a good long stroke like that with no wrist? Pretty good putt there too. Now if I blend that little bit of arm swing and a little bit of softness in the wrist, that'll be more like my own stroke. So you can do this a little bit. You can do it on short putts, medium length here, 15 feet, or long putts. Should you be wristy? I think this is a good thing to try for yourself. Get extreme with it. And when you look at it on video, it won't look that much different. I promise you that.